Hey everyone and welcome back. My name is Kim Dunbar, your color street stylist, and I am going to show you how to apply your strips when they may be just a little bit or a lot too big. And actually this is going to be some really helpful hints for people that are trying to share their manicures with their little girls too. Um, so first things first, all we're doing is just prepping our nails as usual. Um, I've pushed back my cuticles. Now all I have to do is just apply just alcohol to my nails just to uh, soak up some of the oils on my nails. Um, that way it allows the strips to actually seal a lot better. Um, and then what I'm doing is I'm picking the nail strip that is just as close to my nail, if not just a little bit bigger. Um, what I'm trying to do is not give myself too much work. So you take off the film, you have your foil, and your foil holds your base coat, your color, and your top coat. And then when you know that it's too big, you just want to apply your strip with your cuticle and one side of your nail fitting just right or something like that, you know, it takes practice. And then, so that way you only have to work on one side. And then if your nails are short like mine, you see how I was able to just kind of trim that off and just with my thumb, I'm able to take that same strip and use the second half for my other pinky using the same guidelines. And that one actually fits pretty snug. So one thing about Color Street strips is that the cuticles are two, they're two different sizes on each strip. So to make sure that we can try to get the best fit possible. So then you just keep moving on. You have your top film, you have your foil, you take off your little tip there. And then again, just apply as close to your nail as possible along your cuticle line and then on one side if you know that it's going to be big and for me I just prefer it with my thumb um, you can use your nail filer too honestly I, I'm, I'm just lazy I just <laughs> I'm just trying to get this done before Angie wakes up um, so then yep I'm able to use the second half again line it up all the way to the top of my cuticle press it on down and just use my thumb to perforate Perfect, we are getting out of here. And so another trick that I can show you while I'm doing these is that um, these, these are actually considered the solid nail strips and with the solids they are a little bit, um, they have a little bit a different texture than your glitter strips. And sometimes that texture causes them to bunch along the sides at, during your application. Um, and I'll show you how this works on your on the pointer. So I'm bringing it down and you see there's, there's a little bit of bunching. So what I do is I actually lightly lift my nail strip and then I pull it down as I'm getting ready to perforate it. So then that way that relieves whatever little buckling that you may notice when you first apply it. And then yep, use that second half and just do the same thing. I don't know why I noticed the buckling on my pointers versus everywhere else but that's okay because as you see it is what three minutes in and we are knocking this bad boy out of the park yes Manny's in the house well the baby's sleeping and it's already dry so okay you see my knee, my thumb okay don't laugh at me I've been using my thumbs for everything and of course it's broken so what I'm gonna try to do is use my <laughs> nail strips to help to stabilize it while it grows out a little bit too so yep same thing I'm just lining it up on one side putting it all the way up on that cuticle line spreading it all the way nice nice down and easy and then since usually I do use my thumbs to perforate, we're just going to try to do the same thing. And I know the bottoms are gimpy. I'll show you how to fix that in a sec too. And yep, because my thumbs are especially short, I'm definitely able to use just the one strip for this set. Or the one strip for this pair of thumbs. And yep, just do the same thing, just perforate it down. Now, one question you may be asking is, well, Kim, what if I have extra strips and I don't need to use them well? So what I do to store them is I actually just leave them in the little plastic wrap and then I just seal it. But this is what I use for my nails that are too big. You see my little orange stick here? And you can get them at any grocery store or I actually have a bunch of little minis that I keep on me too. 
but I, there's a pointed angle and there's a slanted angle. And I use a slanted angle to go all around the perimeter of my nail, tucking everything in. And as I'm tucking everything in, it's slowly starting to perforate the polish that, ha that doesn't need to be there anymore. And then I'm able to just kind of flick that thing away with my little angle. So this is actually a better, um, a better show of it. So I'm just kind of pushing it around my cuticle there, tucking everything in, getting it nice and snug. And as it's getting nice and snug, the, the set, the color that has nowhere to go, it's just kind of popping off, which makes me happy. Go, go away. And then it leaves me with salon quality manicure and then this manicure will actually last me about yeah about 10 days actually um, and so you just do the same thing with your nail with your thumb too so every all the time you want to work from your pinky to your thumb and you see how trifling this is it's like a perfect rectangle of just disrespect <laughs> but that's okay it's going to be masked it's going to be masked while I'm putting this set on okay and so um, oh yeah I guess there's people that don't know what color street is so color street is 100% nail polish strips you get 16 strips in a pack and so you're able to have enough if you're short nails like mine for your manicure and pedicure and it will last you honestly it will last you about 10 to 14 days the sets range from 11 to 14 um, $14 depending on if you want solids like this one or if you want French tips and I actually have a video of how to apply the French tips as well um, and where can you find them honestly my website is actually on the bottom here peakofpretty.com or if you're in the Broward County area um, you can actually just look for me I'm usually traveling about in different vendor events um, and I always keep a hundred sets on me for you to try sample play with so and then, of course, we always have a special. On my website, everything, all of the sets are actually buy three, get one free. And then the French tips are buy one, get one free. So if you're, if you're interested, if you're curious, or if you want samples, comment below, and I'll definitely try to get you, get them mailed to you. Because, I mean, look at this. I'm, like, it's so pretty, and it's so simple. For those people who are in between salon visits, or maybe you're like me, and you're asthmatic, or and you, and you just don't really want to get to the salon but you want to you want to pamper yourself a little bit this is a really nice option to do it so we are almost done if you have any questions or comments please leave them below um, if you're watching this on YouTube please be sure to like and subscribe and I will talk to you guys later and I'll show you the picture of everything finished on the end all right bye